We have an email here from someone who is asking about the fast food industry. And the thing about it, we look down on the fast food industry. You know, we think that people who work there are not educated. They couldn't find another job because they weren't smart enough. And that's what this person is kind of asking right here. This comes from, I think, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say that this is Haas. It's H-O-S. I don't know if they meant hoes, but <laughs> I think it's Haas. And it says here, have you seen this video of a, uh, a Burger King employee smashing their windows because of a prank? My friends sometimes talk down about people working in fast food. I try to argue this, but uh, he says I try to argue the case where. Damn, what is this you want me to read it? Sound it out, Corey. It's because people's the, writing is they're it's, fucked it's, up. It's it's people's they, writing. I don't have time to go in and, and phrase it the right way. I'll, let me go. Let me take a good look at this. And try this again. I try to argue, but this is one case where I can't because this doesn't look like common sense to me. Do you think this says something about the intelligence of people who work? And fast food. Now, here's the story. Have any of you heard about this? Well, yeah, you sent the email, and I actually did read it, Ray. So, yes, I have. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> it's nice to have a Mexican that does care around here. Now, this email right here is referring to a story where these people at Burger King, they got a call from the fire department. And the fire department said that pressure, and I don't know if they said what kind, but they said pressure is building up inside of Burger King. If you don't want it to blow up, you have to go in there and just break every window in the place. And these employees <laughs> walked outside <laughs> and start kicking in every window. No. No <laughs> fucking way. Man. I mean, karate kicking this shit. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? With, like, their hands, too. I know. I know. Pun punching the windows. Not just kicking, but going in there. I mean... You know, Wolverine must be working at some <laughs> shit, you know. Oh, they're punching the windows. And here's the thing, all right? Let me just say this. There's no shame in working fast food. There's no shame Not at all. in an honest earning, an honest living. There's no shame in going out there and make and getting your money any way that you can, regardless of what it is. But this is fucking stupid right here. <laughs> Except for these <laughs> but these dudes right here. This is fucking, this is dumb as I tried to be nice and rationalize this in the kindest way that I can. I've gone over many scenarios in my head to where this makes sense and I can't say that it does. This is dumb shit. The only thing I can think that makes sense is that they knew it was a prank and just wanted to break some shit. Yeah, like, that's, you know what? that's the only Fuck thing I Burger King. Exactly. Fuck the home of the Whopper. Fuck the king. <laughs> Kick this shit in. Exactly. There you go. People, that's the only way. <laughs> now, now, first of all, <laughs> let's think about this. Y'all know y'all got competition out there. Y'all know Ronald McDonald made that call. So, <laughs> you, know, <laughs> you, know, you know Ronald was in a car with tinted windows on the phone <laughs> looking at this shit and laughing. Y'all know competition was out there. You know people don't like Burger King. You know Wendy's was sitting here somewhere. <laughs> probably next time. They probably went out together. Let's call Burger King and fuck with them. <laughs> they dumb enough to do it. Yeah, they dumb enough to do it. I don't know, man. I think the Dairy Queen is behind this. <laughs> this is from higher up in the hierarchy, man. I'm yeah. not the sharpest tool in the shed, but I never heard of anything being pressurized. Oh. No, you know, ben, yeah, you probably be out there doing this shit. <laughs> Danielle just walked in the video. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, we gotta stop it. <laughs> they're, on, they're on the news, <laughs> you know. But but you look at the name of the city. What was it like, Coon Highway or Coon? Oh, you. It's know like what? a racist that's, ass name when you read it. That's another thing, you know. Like you know, people are putting this story up there because you know racists out there. Talking, well, it is Coon Avenue, so it's you know Coon, it's Coon, Coon Avenue. Rapids. Rapids. Coon, Coon Rapids. Rapids. Oh, Coon, that's worse. Coon, so the, Coon Rapids. So they're the fastest Coons in this like side of the just, Mississippi, or something. Just floating on racial stereotypes. Yeah. Right. Coon Rapids. Coons. <laughs> <laughs> the new ride at Disney World. <laughs> Let's ride Nigger Rapids. <laughs> that's not the rip, the Nigger Rap ride again. <laughs> oh man, let's go to the Wetback Water Park. Coon, <laughs> Coon Rapids, next door to White. Supremacy Hills. People, if you look at the story here, it is called that this is they say a Burger King on Coon Rapids. The Coon Rapids Burger King. <laughs> You're so casual about it. Man, no. you know, it's funny because I, I like I said, I'm trying to be lenient on this shit. And here's the deal with it, man. I, now think about this. Let's let's just think about it. The fire department called <laughs> and told the Burger King, your pressure is building up. <laughs> You gotta break all these windows if you don't want to blow up. 
<laughs> and as they're going outside to do, they open the door and don't think, hey, we should leave this open. Nah, yeah. we gotta, That's ex- Thank like, you. That's exactly it. You know, if, people. <laughs> I, I, Corey's brain shutting down, guys. Hold on. At, during, during the time that these fucking fools walked outside and start breaking shit, Sammy's right. They could have just opened the door. And then have everybody come outside and call the fire department and say, y'all fucking with us. You know, nobody thought about that. Open the doors to really, really, is that that much pressure that, you know, all the doors and windows in there? That's not even a real thing. I know. Yeah. I, I guess exactly. you can mistake it for like gas pressure. Like there's a gas leak or something. And then if you open the doors, back you graph, smell this, it. that. But then you smell it or, or carbon monoxide. Are you, are, uh, yeah, exactly. Some if people it, say, well, it's carbon monoxide. monoxide. It's odorless. But <laughs> the thing is that. You, during that time, they would have had all this. Uh, during the time they were opening the doors, breaking windows, they would somebody had time to think about this and say, "Let us call the fire department and see what's happening." Now, the other part of this is that I don't think that these employees are dumb. I'm not going to say that at all. Mm-hmm. I think that they might have had a dumb manager, and the manager, you know, your kid, you working at Burger King. You don't give a fuck. No. No, 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 no. You just want to go there. You're probably a kid, a teenager. You're a bitter adult. Right. <laughs> you know, you used to be the quarterback in high school. Everybody loved you. Now you're working at fucking Burger King. You know, you don't. You still you think know. you're the king? <laughs> yeah, exactly. You wear those paper crowns all yeah. day. You're wearing those crowns all day. And you just want to do your job and go home. So if the manager tells you, bust all these windows, you're like, well, fuck it. <laughs> hip, 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 hooray. Yeah, you know, I'm thinking that the employees are smarter than the manager. They're like, fuck yeah, I get to go home early if I tear this shit down. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the, <old> Burger King. <laughs> the manager was the dude from uh, Harold and Kumar. Come on, Pookie, let's burn, the- <laughs> burn this motherfucker down, Pookie. Let's go. <laughs> just thinking about those tender little White Castle burgers. <laughs> Those little itty bitty grilled onions that just explode in your mouth like flavor crystals every time you bite into one. <laughs> this makes me want to burn this motherfucker down. <laughs> Come on, Boogie, let's burn this motherfucker down. <laughs> but, <laughs> I love that bit. That's perfect. Burn this motherfucker down, Pookie. <laughs> oh, I love that too. You know, it's kicking in window. Yeah, he's just tearing the shit yeah, you, you you know that when they told them, they said, hey, guys, we got to tear down these windows because some pressure building up in here. You know they went crazy. Come on, Boogie, let's burn this motherfucker down. Come on. Pook is the most dedicated worker they got there. He ain't moved from that cash register yet. <laughs> God damn, man. That's the manager right there. <laughs> Get in the windows, motherfuckers. Those employees don't give a fuck. <laughs> tell me to turn, tell me to bring this shit down. I'll break this shit down. Yeah, I'll tear down this ragged ass Burger King along. I get to go home early. Right. That's a win win. I get to destroy this bitch and I get to go home. <laughs> Why not? You know, oh. shit, I, if, if I was there, I would have relished in that, man. Right. I would, oh, hell yeah. I would have been like goddamn uh, Spike Lee and do the right thing, pick up a trash can. <laughs> <laughs> I would have ran at that motherfucker with a 20 inch TV. Yeah. I would have looted. <laughs> you would have found a TV in there. Yeah. In the I would have found a TV somewhere. <laughs> Stole a box of crowns and shit. Yeah. Come out wearing crowns with PlayStations in my hand and shit. I would have, no, I would have tore that shit down, man. You know, that's. It, 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 <laughs> Destroyed all the burgers. You would have been like Squidward and SpongeBob where he fucking <laughs> steals all the burgers and shit, all the Krabby Patties. <laughs> you take some frozen nuggets with you. Fuck it. I mean, you get to. Because you, you off the hook. Yeah, the manager's the one who's going to have Oh, to, yeah, 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 exactly. I would get in on this too. Yeah. <laughs> I'd be right behind you looting shit too. Hell yeah. <laughs> Kill yeah. someone too. Just <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Get out the purge. You get pressure. Oh, yeah, pull a, pur- pull a purge. Pull a purge. Burger King. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Corey. Let's burn this motherfucker. Burn this motherfucker. Pick up Danielle, throw her yeah. the no. <laughs> You know the because the corporate calls and they say, Why'd you do something that stupid? You tell them, Hey man, 
uh, I was following orders. I do as I'm told. Yeah, yeah exactly. I'm loyal. <laughs> I'm just a burger soldier. I was following orders. You know, <laughs> working army. Yeah, man. But yeah. didn't they say in that article or the news report that there was another prank yeah, that they did prior. the same thing? With, it was another city like Missouri. They had the same call and they did the same shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's not even just you know Coon Rapids. It's you know <laughs> right. it's a whole another state. <laughs> city. Oh, what'd you say? It's a uh, uh, white supremacy. White supremacy avenue. <laughs> <laughs> the whole time this happened, I, I pictured. <laughs> I pictured a Bart. You remember Bart Simpson used to do those pranks? Yeah. <laughs> the whole time he was breaking those windows, I pictured like this shit. Right <laughs> oh my God, that's amazing. <laughs> you know, but if once they find out who made the call, they're going to be in big, big trouble. If they find out. Yeah, they, yeah, they got bigger shit to worry yeah, about. Skype calls. There's a lot of ways you I can don't get know. around. I man. think the police department is thinking, if y'all dumb enough to do this, then... You, you know, deserve your burger. It, it was the up. police department that did it, man. They were like... Well, <laughs> well, the police department was like, we're taking this very seriously as a terroristic threat and da da da, -da. I'm like, shut up. There's a Burger King. Yeah, it's a What's burger. the worst you could take out yeah. a couple play plays? Like, <laughs> they killed windows at Burger King. <laughs> you know, y'all have more important things to worry about. I mean, I'm sure they catch it because, you know, I guess bomb threats are serious. Yeah. But, yeah. but whatever. whatever. That's, yeah. Racco I, Raccoon City for you, man. The, yeah. the thing is, yeah, the zombies the are racco That's the reason why it's Resident Evil. Resident man. Evil. <laughs> That's what happened. It all started with the Burger King. It all started with the Burger King. Yeah. <laughs> Pressure yeah. was building up. We didn't know what to do. Yeah. This is Raccoon City. Yeah. <laughs> Those aren't even employed. Those are zombies right I there. <laughs> <laughs> their legs, like their hands and I feet. Know. Why like, are they? Why are they're they hammers. Weapons. They're just, weapons. Because they don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Working in fast food is just weird anyway. I can kind of understand why these people probably did this. Because you just get stupid shit that happens at fast food. It blends together sometimes. There was a, there was a story that came out right after this where a dude broke into five guys. Did you hear about this? Yeah. No, uh, I didn't. Oh, no. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> no. no, I didn't. I didn't read the email. <laughs> a dude broke into five guys, not to steal money, but to go in there and make a hamburger. Not some burgers, <laughs> but a hamburger. He broke in and, and started working? <laughs> and started working. He broke in to work for five guys. <laughs> It's, uh, the story is so simple and stupid, they didn't even make a big article out of it. It's right here. They said, <laughs> you know, a man broke into five guys in Washington, D.C., made a hamburger. Some cravings just can't be ignored. The end. <laughs> you know, it was, it's simple, man. And five guys paid him. Hey, you did a good job. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> didn't give a fuck about being known, didn't have a disguise, didn't have no mask on, came in and looked straight at the camera. <laughs> if you look, look at him. You look. <laughs> <laughs> and the dude looks like a hipster. Yeah. <laughs> it's like nothing, you know, <laughs> some hipsters smoking out, gotten hungry that night, really wanted five guys, man. Oh, I just don't get it. I, well, I don't get You know what? I don't get it either because now there's somebody who must really love five guys because McDonald's is open 24 hours. Yeah, and all they have is burgers and fries. It's yeah. like five guys, burgers and fries. Go somewhere else where they have like nuggets and I know. everything. Wendy's is open till four. Burger King is open 24 hours. In fact, they got one with broken glass. You can just walk <laughs> yeah. in. Yeah. Walk right in. <laughs> <laughs> Extra entrances. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> People are, have abandoned the place. You can just walk in and get still a burger if you like. No, this dude went in to make a burger. <laughs> it looked right at the camera. It looked right at the camera. <laughs> He's drinking a soda, too. Like, <laughs> <laughs> And you know it's and he did this, he did this all for a burger. He didn't come. He didn't like go in and like do a heist where he stole all the ingredients and he could go home and make a bunch of Five Guys hamburgers. No, he went in just to make one hamburger, <laughs> all for himself. <laughs> just wanted to cook one hamburger. Is he just somebody off the streets or like an employee? Or? They didn't even say. They said they're looking for the guy, which is why <laughs> he's at large because he made the best fucking burger we've ever seen. We went higher. And that's the thing about it, man. He went in there and made one hamburger. He he probably knew he was going to judge. I'm gonna make the best goddamn <laughs> burger you ever tasted. I've ever had in my life. Please go out, man. That's the most money, that's the most lame ass thing I've ever did. Yeah. What do you what are you in jail for? <laughs> Broken to five guys, made a burger, man. Yeah. Making a hamburger. <laughs> what are you in for? I killed five guys. Yeah. <laughs> we, got to, we got something in common then. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> did they make hamburgers? <laughs> man, okay, that's nothing. There was a uh, Dairy Queen, man. Like somebody went up to the window, or not even at the window, at the fucking check in. Where they're like, what do you want, Dairy Queen? He's like, hey, I'm robbing y'all. Um, so I have the money when I get up front. <laughs> so they called the cops or whatever. So they just like, <laughs> then opened up the window and the cops came and like arrested his ass. Like, <laughs> I'm robbing y'all. I'm pull up though. Hold up. <laughs> so so did, did the guy order anything? No, he was just like, hey, I'm a robber. Like, I'm a robber. Because I wonder if they caught him like they, like, 
They gave him the money. They gave him his order, and then they were like, hold on, sir, we're getting your fries ready. Just hold on for a second. Yeah, like, <laughs> like, <laughs> we're making your blizzard right now, sir. Yeah. <laughs> the ice cream machine is not working. <laughs> okay, I'm Mind fucked up shit happens at those, man. It is. Yeah. And it is, this guy, if you're going to be that bold to break in and make a hamburger, one hamburger, don't send this guy to jail. <laughs> make that motherfucker your mascot. Yeah. <laughs> that dude, he's a he, he's a real life hamburger, man. <laughs> you know, put a mask on him and a little hat. <laughs> True. Yeah, let him go in there and cook all these burgers, man. You know, make him your mascot. If he loves your burgers that much, I mean, five guys hamburgers, so good, you break into the fucking place to make one. I would actually, and I'm being serious, I would not send this guy to jail. I would I would not press charges. I would put him on every fucking post around that exactly. Right? Turn, turn the negative into a positive. He's a yeah. slogan. Your campaign right there. Obviously, he'll work for hamburgers. So, yeah. <laughs> Just like Wimpy from Popeye's. <laughs> <laughs> I'll gladly pay you Tuesday. <laughs> I'll break into your five cast <laughs> for hamburger today. Uh, anyway, you know, to answer your question, I, I, no, 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 I don't think we're making fun of these people, but sometimes we never know what we do in that situation. I don't yeah, right. you, you know, never know. I mean, you t- someone, when someone says something's going to explode, you never know what you do. So I would like to think I would not be that dumb, but <laughs> you never know. You never know. You've done dumber shit. Like what? I don't know. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like break into my job and clock in. <laughs> I, if, Mar- if Martin was here, we would have a whole fucking Rolodex of dumb shit. Oh, believe me. <laughs> you know, I, I I love Brother Martin. I've protected him for so long. Martin has done some dumb shit. Oh, me. I'm sure. And I have not said anything. I am the Jesus of dumb shit. I let people <laughs> talk about dumb you shit. You fucked a vacuum, so <laughs> let's start there. <laughs> That's pretty dumb, actually. Actually, no, it's not dumb. That's but he didn't f- break into a vacuum store and fuck the vacuum. <laughs> <laughs> That's a, yeah. That Thank does you. take it up a notch. Yeah. <laughs> he fucked into the privacy of his own home. I did it. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Sammy. Yeah. <laughs> We've all fucked a few vacuums in yeah. our day. Okay, Daniel? What I do in my home, that's one thing. Yeah. But, you know, seat cushions. <laughs> <laughs> Hoover vacuum, so good. You want to break it and fuck yeah. her. I didn't. Ca- I didn't get caught in the appliance section of Best Buy. Look at the camera about to go fuck a vacuum cleaner. So and wink, and <laughs> wink at it. Hey. 